Anglers, I'm Darcy from Lucky Tackle Box. I'm here to introduce to you the Lunker Hunt Spud Jig from LunkerHunt.com. Just one of the five baits you received in your Lucky Tackle Box subscription this month. So stick around while I show you a little how-to on the target use, rigging, and proper retrieval of this lure. The Spud is the ultimate jigging spoon. Balanced to perfection, the Spud is designed for peak performance. The Spud comes in six colors and three eighths and one half ounce weight sizes. Multifaceted surfaces reflect light and feather trebles pulse as the Spud cuts through the water. This is a jig, so typically you're going to want to use it to target those deeper holes and channels. Due to the extra sharp treble hook, you're going to want to throw this jig in open water and not around too much weed, debris, or structure. The spud jig will work great on all types of inshore saltwater snappers, such as lane and mangroves, as well as ladyfish, bluefish, and jacks. Now for the rigging. For my rod, I'm using a Tsunami 7'2 Coastal Series Airwave Rod, and I have the rod paired with my reel, which is an Accurant SR6 spinning reel, and the reel is spooled with 15-pound braid, and then I have my leader attached to that, and I have a two-foot leader, 30-pound fluorocarbon leader. You can use 20 up to 40-pound fluorocarbon leader, depending on the water clarity and the fish you're targeting. And I have the lure, the spud jig, attached with a cinch knot. A uni knot or cinch knot will work just fine. On the retrieval, you can mimic injured bait by pounding the bottom for a reaction strike or lift and drop at different depths to catch feeding fish. The spud draws them in and generates strikes no matter how the fish are biting. Now that you know how to use it, get out there and try your Lunker Hunt spud jig. Let me know how you do with it in the comments below this video. Once again, on behalf of Lucky Tackle Box, I'm Darcy Arahill. You can find me on social media, Roku, and YouTube as Darcizzle Offshore. And until next time, keep on catching.